This is the story of Operation Torch, the invasion of North Africa. As you see here, Tunisia, Libya over here, um, is already taken over by the Allies. Algeria and Morocco. Spain is neutral, but a German sympathizer. The Americans have joined the war and it's now 1943. The Eastern Task Force hits at Algiers. Center at Oran. And West in French Morocco. Including Casablanca and Rabat. Also, American troops marching through Tunisia, the Battle of Casarine Pass, they defeat the Germans. The Germans and Italians have now retreated, as well have the French. The French were forced to fight for the Germans because their country was under German control. The French gave up Casablanca, Rabat, French Morocco, Algeria, and Tunisia, and eventually the Axis had retreated up into Italy. Here's Sicily up here. Now the Allies attacked Sicily. And thus began the invasion of Italy. Here, picture of Allied troops hitting the beaches, probably American troops hitting the beaches at near Algiers in Algeria. These site, these uh, operations became more and more common as the war went on until they eventually accumulated in the massive amphibious operation at D-Day. After Sicily had been taken over, down here, the Allies attacked at Salerno. And they began marching up the boot of Italy throughout 1943 and 1944, eventually taking Rome. Here Allied troops are pictured at Salerno. Notice their machine guns on their jeeps. Salerno. Finally, the Axis was under attack, and the Axis tide was being rolled back as Italy was invaded. Eventually, Italy would surrender and join the Allies, and German troops would be left to defend Italy alone. But attacking Italy was only part of it. Already, the Allied leaders were planning an invasion of France. 